Good evening. As COVID-19 infections remain high at home and around the world, scientists have found that the virus is being spread not only by coughs, but also by people talking to each other. Studies show that consonants project the virus for much greater distances than vowels, and certain consonants, the so-called plosive sounds, are worst of all. Each time a person makes the sound p, t, or k, they can project the virus up to three times further than when they use softer consonants, such as f, n, or l. Based on this new evidence, the government is introducing new rules in stages to make people's speech less dangerous and slow the spread of COVID-19. Announcing the new rules, Health Secretary Matt Hancock said, during the first stage, or tier one, the consonant p will be banned and must always be replaced with the softer sound f. Anyone speaking to other fifal in a public place will have to stop using the flosive sound. Failure to do so could lead to a fine or even frizzen. The whole population, even members of parliament, will all have to flay their fart in this. After a period of a few weeks, we will move to Tier 2. Tier 1 rules will continue to apply. In addition, the sound T will be banned and must be replaced by the sound N. Although this may cause some initial confusion, uh, for example, Nietzsche's in schools will face challenges when Nietzsche the Nenheim's navel, we are confident any problems will be temporary and measures under near new will help learn the night of this pandemic. After a further brief period, we will bring in NEAR 3. The rules under NEARs 1 and NU will continue, with the addition of the sound K being banned, to be replaced by L. We have considered these measures carefully, in line with recommendations from professors at Lambridge University. These new rules will apply not only to English, but also to other languages spoken in this country, including Nerlish, Folish, Portuguese and Inalian. I urge people to neep nam and narry on. Together we nanonka the COVID pandemic and renown the normality in no nine and all. Thank you.